Lone Star, where are you? Out tonight, feeling I'm trying to find. Oh my God! Hi. Hey. Hi. Hey. 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 <laughs> You cut your hair. Yes. <laughs> it looks great. Yes, thank you. <laughs> remember that time you grew a beard and then you shaved it and I didn't remember what your face looked like so I cried? Yes. Uh, <laughs> yes, that was beautiful. Do I look the same to you? Um, have you lost weight? I mean, if I have, it's only a few pounds. I just think people remember me fatter, so... Oh, no, Hannah, you were never fat. You were always soft and round like a dumpling. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. So how's work? Are you still at the archival footage place? Oh, no, no. I have taken an exciting new position oh. as the assistant to the curator of the dance. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's, uh, it's unpaid, but, you know, it could very well lead to something. Um, you know, what about you? How's the writing going? Oh, well, it's actually great. I'm almost done with the book of essays, mm, so... It was amazing. Yeah. Is it titled? Uh, right now, it's Midnight Snack is the title. Is this the working title? Well, you know, there's plenty of titles. So, I'm really glad to see you. I mean, really, really glad to see you. I, I've been thinking about wanting to speak with you for a long while. Well, Elijah, um, I'm really happy to see you, too. Um, I don't want to mislead you. I did mm -hmm. not bring you here to retread old territory emotionally. Okay. I'm more open to it physically. Okay. And I actually brought you here to talk about something pretty specific. All right. Um, it's a little touchy, and I don't want to make any assumptions about you and other partners, but... It's true. It's true. It's true, and I hate that you found out through the post-collegiate rumor mill, but you know, I'm really glad that you know now, because you know, things with Bo and me are just moving so quickly, and I just felt like we were gonna run into you someplace, like, you know. Bo? Oh, yeah, that's his name, Bo. And Bo is? My lover. Who's male? Yes. Oh, I did not know that. Okay. Oh. So. Oh. So you're you're gay? Well, um, uh, I don't really say gay. I mean, I, I don't really say straight either. I am with someone mm -hmm. of the same gender mm -hmm. as I am. So you know, essentially, that makes means that I'm experimenting. Like, um, which I love. Thank you. Which I love. Uh, Hannah. No. Mm -mm. Hannah. No. Hannah. Don't. Don't. Okay. 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 I am fine. Uh, what I'm having right now is um, an inappropriate physical reaction to my total joy for you and your self-discovery. Thank you. And and. Just so you know, I mean, this exploration is very much inspired by you. Um, I do explore. Yeah, you do. Um, I mean, right now I'm seeing this guy, and, and sometimes I let him hit me on the side of my body, so... I, uh, uh... It's great that you're seeing somebody. Yeah, it is. So does this mean that the whole time we were together, you were... Oh, um, are, are you asking, like, when we were together, was I always attracted to men? Uh, yes. Um, are you asking, did I think of men when we were together? Yes. Well, so then, how did you have sex with me? 
Well, Hannah, there's, there's always been a handsomeness about you. Oh, my God. Oh, God, that wasn't the right thing to say. I, I, mean, uh... no. I am very, very happy for you. Thank you. That really means a lot. But I, I, I do wish that you could have maybe figured this out a little bit sooner, like maybe when we were at Liberal Arts College, because, you know, there were a lot of gay men there. Okay, you know, I'm just feeling a lot of aggression coming from you right now. And also, I just want to let you know that the reason I brought you here was not to discuss our past relationship, but to discuss the fact that I have an STD, and I'm pretty fucking sure you gave it to me. What, why would you think that? Uh, because I'm having protected sex with my current boyfriend, and also he doesn't have HPV. HPV? He was tested and he doesn't have it. He was tested. Uh, well, that's absurd. Why is that absurd? Because there is no test for men. And if your boyfriend even took an introduction to sexuality workshop, he would know that. Okay, so you're saying you don't have it. I am saying there is no possible way for me to know. And quite frankly, Hannah, I resent the accusation. You, you, you were always like this. Okay, this is not the time for you to throw stones because I am the one that was lied By to. By who? By you for two years. Oh, well, I think it was Maya Angelou who said we are only as blind as we want to be. Oh, so, so I was supposed to know that you were gay. Because let me tell you something, this fruity little voice Excuse that you me? on is a new thing. Fruity little voice. Fruity little... Keep it down. Is this about the scarf? It is not about the scarf. Uh, the scarf is not helping the situation, but it is about your tone of voice. It is about your mannerisms. And in my opinion... You know what? I am being myself. I am being my authentic if self. If you had been this gay in college, I would have known because I have two eyeballs, two ears. You know, I think you really need to take a step back and maybe, you know, look at your past boyfriends before me. And just for shits and giggles, why don't you think about your dad for a minute or two? You didn't just. Oh, I did. In what way does my father read gay to you? Uh, he has a stud in his ear. Yeah, he got that on a trip he took with a bunch of his male friends. Mm. Mm -hmm. I heard what that sounded like. Mm. Are we hearing I, ourselves? I heard what that sounded like. Are we hearing like. ourselves? Because I don't think we are. You know what I'm going to do from now on? What are you going to do? I'm going to ask people if they're gay before I have sex with mm. them. Good luck with that. Yeah, good luck with that. And you know... Don't be surprised if you get asked the same question if you keep dressing the way that you do. I am going to have the last word in this conversation. Uh, it was so good catching up with you. No. Your dad is gay. No! You are just don't know the distance I'm willing. Pick up a stone